You have started RS Express. You will now specify general settings in the Options dialog, which is the basis for creating models. This video shows how to model an organizational chart. You will also learn what role individual items play in an organizational chart. To open a new model, click on Organizational Chart in the Model Types area. You have already learned how to place panes according to your requirements in another video. We only need the Symbols pane right now. Models of the organizational chart type are used to describe the hierarchical structure of organizations. The models show to which departments and organizational levels employees belong. As an example, you will model the organizational structure of the My Favorite Book Express company. This company sells books on the Internet. The first object you will place is an organizational unit. It can represent a department or a location in an organizational hierarchy. Enter Management and click on the object outside the text box. You have just modeled the unit that represents the top level of the company's hierarchy. You will now assign the person in charge. Since the object is still selected, the mini toolbar is displayed. You can use it to place the person object. As this example indicates, you can assign a given person to an organizational unit. Below Management, you will add the four departments Purchasing, Logistics, IT and Accounting in a single step. Select the organizational unit in the Symbols pane, press and hold the Control key and place the four departments. Now you release the control key and will enter names for these objects. To do this, click on an object, press the F2 key and enter the name of the object. Click on the connection symbol in the mini toolbar, press and hold the control key and click on the target objects. The management object is now connected to all subordinate departments. Next, you will assign roles to each department. Roles are used to group persons by their tasks. You can easily realign an awkwardly placed connection by using its anchor point. The other departments have equivalent roles. Insert the roles and realign the objects. You can also assign persons to objects of the role type. All persons assigned to the same role have the same tasks. You will now create such an assignment. You complete the model by assigning persons to the remaining roles and by aligning all connections and objects. It is now time to save the results. Save the model as My Favorite Book Express Organizational Chart. A thumbnail of the saved model has been added to the list of recently used models in the home area. You can conveniently open it from here. You have modeled the organizational structure of the My Favorite Book Express company. You will later use some of its organizational units when modeling a business process. 
the persons assigned to these units will perform the tasks in the business process.